Dear my late night diary. How am I doing? Would be probably a hit or miss. You know? Or, in this case, a hit and miss. However, I might be doing a tiny bit better. You know, just a tiny bit. I've been playing some random games today. And I'm gonna be honest. Going back into playing the games that I've ever played in my childhood would be really nice. But at the same time, probably wouldn't do anything. Cause I... The joy and the happiness and the nostalgia while playing them has been lost from long ago. But maybe most of the games that used to fuck me up and turn me into what I used to have me quote unquote fucked up are pretty much the only key. Like how I used to be a big fan of Snatcher and um. <clears throat> Snatcher and Police Notes and Metal Gear 2. Like, me, me being a fan of them had probably got me fucked up. But then again, it would make me forget a little bit. Maybe. Maybe it'll be about time for me to start talking in. The servers that I wasn't ever active in. And, you know, truly share to the true people who deserve that I can share to them. Pretty much an experience about a game or something. Like, most of you people know that I'm into most of the goddamn retro game ports, right? And this whole thing was inspired by by some most of the channels. Shoutouts to RetroCore. Like it's pretty much the main pinnacle for the the retro gaming ports comparison with games and ports that nobody has ever seen, or probably have seen, who knows, <sighs> and um, I'm only gonna have two days until my semester, second semester begins, still haven't got the results yet, but let's just hope that these results do not screw me up more. Or else, I think everyone who hates me would actually get what they wanted to get, you know? And it is me dying. <sighs> you know, I've learned a lot of valuable lessons during my time on the internet. And one of them is that being into it in the first place was a mistake. Watching YouTube as a normal guy, maybe. Watching hentai and other stuff as a normal guy is also a maybe. Downloading and looking up stuff as a normal guy, yes. But being as a part of it and commenting, writing, chatting, all of it was a mistake, but then, um, you know how it goes nowadays, <sighs> the thoughts are subject to change, maybe, but as a matter of fact, I just want to forget. I just want to forget and move on and live the rest of my life and uh, and maybe one day regain what I have actually lost for a long time as a gamer. Not the games that I've played or what I have wanted to play, 
but the enjoyment of playing them. Because really, nowadays, any game nowadays feels completely empty. Because I don't enjoy them like how I used to back in the day. <sighs> and yet they call me a guy with no life. If I was really a guy with no life, then why in the hell I would be talking like this, or even bother being in here? In fact, if a game, being a guy with no life means being on social media and searching for decent people and talking decently and being inspired and fighting your own parents and screwing up everything and sacrificing everything means a guy with, with no life then I guess everything that is fucked up and its opposite is called a guy with a life <sighs> sometimes I just want all of this to go away and just sleep forever. Well, who knows? Maybe one day everyone gets to be an equal, which is, of course, a wish that will never become true because we humans are such a stupid ass species like we're never gonna stop fucking each other up as long as there's someone out there who's just gonna do everything and actually succeed in it to literally make us kill each other for the stupidest reasons and especially for the past. We live in a society. We truly live in a society. Hopefully one day, hopefully one day I can actually return to being that one kid that cared about nothing else but video games and its ports that no one ever knows about or no one even plays or touches or is able to buy or download I mean circumstances vary for a game or another in fact I just wish that I would just go back into being that one gamer that have Zero brain, zero fucking heart. <laughs> Boy. Swooshity, swooshy, swoosh. What does that mean? Nothing is straight. Everything is permitted. And nothing is illegal. And most of all, Everybody is a liar. Don't trust anyone. At all. Only trust yourself. Only trust what even your own area and home, no matter how fucked up it is, always trust what they say. And most of all, trust your own God. Trust your God. Because He really knows best. My God, have, I should have trusted my God long ago when he stopped me from being into this platform or Discord or Twitter from even the core. <sighs> yeah. <sighs> Look at me saying all this kind of stuff. Sometimes, one day, if 
I can just enjoy playing my video games again while forgetting every single social media or anything that was related to it. <laughs> I'll be pretty much the happiest guy. I wouldn't even need to travel or to meet anyone or to have money or to even pass college. I just want to play some goddamn video games. <laughs> and that's it. <sighs> that's enough for me today because it's it's a late night one and hopefully tomorrow hopefully by tomorrow or after tomorrow or even by the beginning of the second semester I would I would recover and then maybe I could go back into I don't know. I don't even know what am I supposed to go back into or what am I supposed to do. <laughs> but we just gotta make sure to just isolate ourselves. Isolation is the key, people. Don't go outside. Don't meet any people. Don't try with anyone else. Don't trust. Only your house, your laptop, your bed, your napkin, and everything that you ever have left them born and slept with, you just stick to it. Anything else about getting alive or meeting someone or touching grass or smelling some fresh air all a lie, okay? Because they want you to explore. They want you to get hurt. That's just how the world is. That's just how fucked up it is. Especially on the fucking internet. <sighs> Alright, I'm gonna stop here. And hopefully, by tomorrow or something, Things get better.